Hello and welcome to my channel, The Ordinary Legend. My name is Andrew. Today we're going to be checking out the premiere episode of Halo, the new series that is based on a game that is on Paramount+. Plus. Right, this series Halo is based on a very popular game, which I have never played. Well, I've never played the campaign. My cousin used to have it on Xbox. And I played it with him a few times, but we just like ran around on a, on a map and just ran around killing each other for hours. So I have no idea what the main storyline is. The only name I know is Master Chief. And that's it. I don't know any other character's name. Or story points or plots or anything like that. Alright, I'm going to check out the overall synopsis of the first season. Just so I can get a bit of context on the series. It says here, Mankind's very future is threatened when our past crossed with, with a powerful alien alliance, the Covenant. So a group of aliens have come together to call themselves the Covenant. Okay. It says here that it takes place in the year 2552. All right, guys, my main questions before the series starts are, is this going to be the first time that humans have come across aliens? Or have we met a lot of different aliens, species and cultures already? It's an alien alliance, so I'm assuming there's, they have a different kinds of aliens on there, so... I don't know why we couldn't be a part of that alliance. Or they just deem us inferior and try to attack us. I have a lot of questions about the alien alliance. You know, what kind of aliens are in it? Why they created the alliance to start with? And what they plan to do about other alien species that don't, that aren't in the alliance. Mainly I want to know if the alliance is a good thing or a bad thing. You might want to join the alliance instead of trying to fight them off. Especially if you're alone. All these different kinds of aliens in the alliance versus us. Doesn't seem really seem like a fight that will win. Those are really only my main questions before starting. I'm sure we'll get more as we get into the season. Alright guys, let's get into Halo Episode 1. Of the Marines and their super weapons, the Spartans, to crush us. But war need not be the answer. And that is why Jinhar has sent me. That guy is familiar. From Torchwood. Also a season of The Expanse. One Spartan is worth a hundred million. Uh, Spartans aren't human. They're faster, stronger, smarter. We cannot be stopped. We just keep on killing. Without mercy. Spartans, eh? I'm guessing Master Chief is going to be one of them. Juan, the UNSC owns the galaxy. So the UNFC owns the galaxy. It only took humans 500 years to conquer the galaxy. It's interesting. They must have encountered aliens before. <laughs> oh! Shit! <laughs> hey. Shooting kids here? Didn't see that coming. Didn't know it was going to be that kind of show. Silver fight. Get your weapons. Let's see how they fight. Uh, this looks like regular guns to me. I thought they'd have better weapons. Well, these guys are outgunned. Personal shield. Laser swords, energy weapons, and these guys are still using bullets. Man, they're tanks. I have to go. I have to help. Are we gonna die? <laughs> Looks like it. Oh, of course not. We're warriors, aren't we? Yeah, They're just mowing straight through them. 
Mm. Holy mother of God, it's all true. What? What's true? I thought it was UNSC propaganda. Shit. UNSC. Here comes the big guys. Hopefully they got the tech to fight these guys. Spartan. Nice. So you gotta let them work, dude. They don't stand a chance without them. So our team engaged. So we got four Spartans. Hmm. Even they're scared of them. Double tap. I think they got a uh, personal shields too. Nice. <laughs> nice. I love their headshots. Weapons aren't very good long distance. Kai, hold your position. That looked bad. <laughs> Minigun works good long distance. Quiet. This is gonna be bad. <laughs> Those laser swords are awesome. Yeah, they like their face shots. Correction. She's the only survivor. Yep, a team of four Spartans took out 20 elite soldiers from the Covenant. Seems like the Spartans are better killing machines, but the Covenant have way better weapons. Eh? The laser swords. The energy weapons, they're way better than the guns that the Spartans use. It's like the Spartans have had many run-ins with these guys already. But they didn't seem to know who they were, this little colony. So I wonder how well known these alien threats are. Is that the only settlement on the planet? There's got to be more. Somewhere. Covenant excavation. Cave network does not appear to be a natural formation. They were looking for something. It must have been an old settlement of theirs. Was that him as a kid? Must have been. Why did it show him that for? No. Go with the others. That's not procedure. Go with the others. Hmm. That's an order. One encounter with that thing is already disobeying procedure. Maybe it awakened some part of his humanity that was lost. We've been fighting these alien creatures for years and we still have no idea what they want, where to find them or how to beat them. Get rid of that and any others. Clear? Clear. Mm, what you cooking up in there? Okay. I don't know what that is. Maybe some kind of AI. Cyborg thing. 
She looks human. Why does she look human? Janok Eba Mosanajut Inji Kito. Seems like they took her and raised her. She might be the only human there. The energy pulse is stimulating his connective tissue. Always from contact with a piece of rock. It definitely changed him. And your neural lace metrics, any anomalies? Ooh, is he gonna lie? I saw things. Yeah. When I touch the object. When he lands, you bring him straight here. Right. What are they gonna do? They're gonna try to wipe him back to what he was? Or are they trying to just kinda keep a close eye on him, see what happens? So what happens now to the girl? Quan Ha was badly wounded in the AI attack on Mandrigal. Despite our best efforts, she succumbed to our injuries. What? What are they doing? It is not that simple. It is that simple. It's, it's an Article 72. What, dude? She's a kid. Bearing a teenage girl. Yep. I'll move there now. I need some independence. Point in saving humanity if we're gonna give up our own. Sometimes you have to make hard choices to get good results. Yeah, that's not a hard choice. That's the easy choice. Just kill your problems away. They don't eat? Didn't see anything I liked? No. Master Chief's not gonna be able to do it now. You know, we've actually met before today. When was this? When you killed my mother? Can't turn around without staring at an uplink about humanity's best weapon. He is that. A weapon. ETA is still several hours. And then what? That's still being worked out. Whoop. He's not the same person. I think before we touched the rock, if you got that order, you would have killed her straight then. Right then. Uh -oh. They're losing control of their weapons. Rather than execute the rebel as ordered, he has decided to kill the video feed from his ship. What's going on? Hmm. They call him a rebel instead of a teenage girl. Which is precisely why the Cortana system could be There is fine. no Cortana system, Catherine. No cloning, no Cortana. Is that clear? What is the Cortana system? Put up the alarm. Scramble everyone to landing bay. Full foreign protocol. Do you respect we are talking about our most important military asset? Yeah. Well, I don't think he's that anymore. <laughs> Seems like a bit of overkill. Superseding those orders. Whatever he's experiencing, there are other available solutions. Uh, he's experiencing a conscience. So they have to kill him. If they go after Chief, they're not friendlies. Correct, Dr. Halsey? Correct. Alright. I wonder how many teams of Spartans there are. Time for the big reveal. Oh, I know this actor from something. If you want me dead, you'll need to aim up here. I definitely know that actor from somewhere. Just can't think of where from at that moment. And you just decided to help me. Why would a Spartan do that? I don't know. He really doesn't. So what now? You can need that. Your Spartan just gave an insert of the rifle. He gave a child that you're trying to kill a weapon <laughs> to protect herself. So what are we waiting for? I thought you had control. I do. See how good his flying skills are. Well, let's see what this stone triangle thing does. Oh, 
that's a different kind of energy. Is it? Let's EMP. Some kind of connection with it from when he was a kid. Strap in. Do these guys have some kind of hyperdrive? Right. No hyperdrive. Right, guys, that was episode one of Halo. If you made it this far, give this video a like. And comment down below about your thoughts on the episode. If you are one of the people that played the game, let me know how this episode differs from the the main story of the game. Just to the things that pertain to this first episode. Don't go into the future parts of it. And subscribe to my channel for future reactions to this series.